call annoying. I can't. <laughs> That's exactly what I do with him. Are you gonna cut your bang a bit shorter today? Uh, cut the cut and bang? Yeah, be sure. Tourism organization has achieved this year and what they've got in line for 2022. So let's give a big round of applause. Okay, so Paul. Oh, wait, Paul are you supposed Hart to do it? Phil Hart of Sorts and Parts. Okay, and then. Oh my god, I need to tell you about that driver. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, guys, I okay. have a story to tell you. <laughs> oh, story time! I have a story to tell story you. Story time! Okay, so like, I was at her place last night, and then I called like an Uber, and I hadn't even gotten to the car yet. I was just walking to the car, and the car has like a huge dent in the side of the door. Like, like it looked like it was just in an accident. Uh. And I was like, <laughs> was it safe? But then I was like, okay, like, you know, let's not judge based on the condition of wow, the car. Yeah. And so I get on the car, and as soon as I get on the car, the driver was like, I'm so sorry, but they have a really beautiful driveway. Like, can I just get off and take a photo of the driveway? Our driveway? No, not your driveway. Like, the opposite? The opposite. She was just like staring outside the window being like, they have such a nice driveway. Like, I'm sorry, but we just got our driveway done, and they did a really bad job on our driveway. So I want to take a photo of this driveway to send to those people to show them how they should have done our driveway. <laughs> uh, and then I'm like, okay. <laughs> and she just like gets off the car. Oh, and damn it, I wish I was like standing outside to see that. And then That's she like so spent funny. three minutes taking photos of your opposite neighbor's yeah. driveway. Gets back on the car and she's like, I'm so sorry, like they had such a good driveway. <laughs> and I was like, oh. <laughs> and then she's like, anyway, how are you? And I'm like, I'm good. And she's like, okay, um, tell me about your life. <laughs> Why? And she was like, are you visiting a friend? Did you just get off work? Did you have a good day? And then I was like, yeah, I was just visiting a friend. And she's like, what even is this building called? Like, like is it a townhouse? Like a duplex apartment? <laughs> it's just a freestanding house. You know what? I'm telling you it's a townhouse, but with no common walls. Like, I tell you. Like, that's what it is. Yeah. I was like, oh, okay. And she's like, what is this suburb called? And I was like, I really don't know. So we were driving and she like keeps talking right and then cuz like I was like, oh, yeah, I am not yeah. the type to initiate a conversation with someone I don't know So she kept asking me and she's like, what do you do? What's your job? And I was like, oh, I film videos Cuz like I can't lie. Yeah, yeah, but I also like don't want her to stalk my YouTube yeah, channel Yeah, and then they're always like, what's your channel name? So I was like, oh, yeah, I film videos and then she's like, so you make movies and I was like, yes <laughs> Not quite then like what do you do like you said you film videos and i'm like yeah they're like shorter than movies and she's like oh so like two minute videos like you film ads and i was like no like what? it's like you know 10 to 20 minutes and then she was like then that's basically a movie and i was like i guess you could oh. say so she's like so what do you film and i was like oh i just you know i film my life and she's like ah so it's like a diary and i'm like yeah it's basically uh -huh. a diary to myself and then she's like oh when i was in year eight i used to write diaries but then i came home one day and my mom burnt them all because my mom was schizophrenic and then she thought i was trying to kill her and then, what? yeah and i was like oh my god and then like i like you know, what do you like, even say? I know, I felt like I should say like, is your mom okay now? But I was really worried that she'd say that her mom wasn't here anymore uh, so I couldn't like ask uh, it, right? So I was like, oh, like, that's so sad. And she's like, yeah, like all my memories were in there. And then I was like, oh. And then I didn't know what else to say, right? <laughs> she was like leading the conversation the whole time and like I didn't know what to say so I just didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. So we were driving in silence for 30 seconds and then she's like, I knew it. If I don't talk, no one talks. I thought I was driving alone on this uh... car by myself. I forgot that you were sitting on this car. And then she was like telling me off for like what? not talking enough. Yeah, I felt so attacked. Oh my god. She came for you. Yeah, because like Alina was messaging me. I wasn't replying to her for a while. And then Alina was like, are you? Yeah, I was like, where did she go? And then I got told off. <laughs> 
why the women for not talking to for not talking. Enough? What the heck? I <laughs> swear, my ideal Uber ride is like you get in, they're like hello, and then you're like hello, and they're like how are you? I'm fine, thanks. And then you just don't say anything uh-huh. until you get to where you're going, yeah. and then they're like thank you, and then I'm like thank you, and then that's it. And I'm like five stars, like yeah, amazing. Bye. Like that was amazing. Loved yeah, it. Yeah, but she just like kept talking to me. It was just kind of scary, and I felt like you know if I stopped talking, that would be dangerous. You get in trouble. Like, I know. Get in trouble. You have to like ask her more about her life. Yeah, so I had to like keep talking to her. And then you know how like when you get off, the app tells you to rate your driver. And I was like worried because if I gave her anything less than a five star, she knows where I live. Like I was like, <laughs> like I felt like, like she your window. Come for me. Yeah. What the heck? Yeah, it was really scary. And you know, that's like the uh, best way to like stress you out. Like put you in like an awkward situation like that. That's like the best way to make I it stress. <laughs> wow. That was my night. How was yours? Yeah, yeah, it was good. <laughs> that's so funny. Hello everyone! I feel like I didn't really get to show you guys my hair the other day because I was just in a rush to get places. But this is my freshly turned hair. Very happy with it. Highly recommend Eclat Atelier. For those of you who are in Sydney, they always do such a good job with my hair. And this is actually probably gonna be one of the last times that you see me with normal colored hair. At least next time I go in, I definitely plan on doing something a little more creative with my hair color. I've already promised I would go lighter for the summer. So next time I go in, I am probably going to do... I don't know what color yet, but definitely something a little more creative than my usual brown. Anyways, I have locked myself in my room for the past two days because I am so behind on editing. I think I'm like currently two weeks behind right now. I've just been so busy. I've had plans every single day and then as soon as I get home, I'm just exhausted and want to sleep. So I haven't had time to edit for a very long time. I definitely need to get a new vlog out by this weekend. I just feel like I've had so much going on recently, especially this month of December is going to be a very important month for me. I have a lot of things happening. I haven't even had time to sit down and update you guys yet. Like even now, I am just about to head out for dinner with Rachel and Wilson. It's literally like dripping down. Yeah. Whoa. We got the famous honeycomb makgeolli, but women to middle. Literally, it's just like at the bottom. It doesn't mix. Yeah, it doesn't mix. It's just like... <laughs> Wow, this better taste nice. This piece of honeycomb was five dollars, guys. One piece of Did you lick your chopstick? It tastes exactly the same. It's just like my colleague. It's a I don't taste any honey. Are you meant to like get some honey and then drink the makgeolli when you have the honey? Are you meant to bite it and then drink it? No, I like bet it says, are you meant to do it like a Tim Tam to them? <laughs> 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 no way. You didn't do it, Meg. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get the, get the egg. <laughs> 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 we both just left Wilson outside because we saw that they had a pretty bathroom. Wow. Sauce Wilson. Hope you're having a good time outside. Outside by yourself. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, I hit him. Oh, that was yeah. such a good shot. Today is a not so sunny Saturday, but um, it's a very big day for me because I am going apartment hunting for the very first time in Sydney at least. Uh, very excited but also very nervous. This has been in the plans for quite a while now but I've just been so busy and this is like the first day that I've managed to make time to go to inspections. I organized them last night and I have around 15 to 20 inspections lined up for today. So I'm just gonna be zooming all over the place. The goal is to move out by the end of this month or early next month. Really hope we can make this happen. So let's go attend our inspections. Um, I just finished my first inspection. <laughs> I actually met a subscriber at the door. Of all places, I was not expecting to bump into people at inspections, but hi, Helen. I'm running really late for my next inspection right now. So I'll rush there first and talk to you guys soon. Let's go. Door open. 
going off. breakfast today guys I've just been oh, running back and forth between all these apartments <laughs> someone just give me an apartment like 20 apartments that day i was running everywhere and i didn't really find any places that i really liked there were some places that were okay but i'm still hoping that i can find somewhere that i'll like really really like so yeah i haven't put in any applications yet but i did spend the entire morning making phone calls to agents to arrange private inspections for tomorrow these past few days Plus this coming week is just going to be hectic for me because if you guys remember I bought a house a while back. I think like a lot of you guys thought that I was going to live in it but I actually bought it as an investment property. So I'm renting it out to someone else and then I'm going to be renting myself in Sydney. So that property, the settlement date is going to be this Thursday and I've just been calling so many people to arrange my insurance, get in contact with my conveyancer and then arrange for my property manager to to attend the pre-settlement inspection for me. I'll just be lying in bed and my brain won't rest because I have so many things to plan. I take out my phone and start writing a to-do list and it ends up with like 20 things that I need to do the next day. So yeah, running on four hours of sleep a day for the past week now and I don't know how I'm surviving because I'm the type that needs a full eight hours of sleep to function. My investment property is settling on Thursday, which is like in three days. And then I'm hoping to sign the lease on an apartment this week as well. Okay, we are ready to head out. I've got my Ana Luisa necklace on. This is the one that I designed. The Nessie necklace currently on sale and I think it would make a great Christmas gift. It matches well with everything I wear every single day so it'll be linked down below as always. <laughs> <笑>我們還想著哎呀應該然後很多人在看說還可以跟他們砍價嘛但是我因為那顆有二十個人給我切我不好意思看了不會砍價不能砍價你們吃<笑><笑> <笑>好有默契哦 
掉完就走，就完全<笑>给我看个屁股，完全没有反应。<笑>你看这个，我买了个这个嘛，这个是皮层，嗯哼，是那个 Travis Scott 的 blanket， 还是 McDonald， 嗯，我还买了一个超级大的那个 nugget， 特别丑，这被子吗？不是，是一个抱的啊，抱枕，我不知道为什么这么丑。<笑>真的好丑那玩意儿，这玩意儿真的很丑。你为什么会想特别这个呢？当时我真的以为它是小的，然后呢，你看它又大又丑，然后又不像真的。那它有时候肯定很好看，然后我拿到的时候，整个人懵了。Oh my god！ 哎，但是感觉更远了看还 OK， 真的是吗？嗯。但是你看，你尽量看。<笑>真实看就特别假，这也是 Travis Scott 的吗 ？Travis Scott McDonald 合作的，当时哦，这个也是，嗯，你都没把它拿出来，嗯，我不知道干嘛。这是不是限量的？你可以卖啊。嗯，但我又不舍得卖。但我在这看、啊，是不是特别大、啊？<笑>把它下掉。然后有你，你看一个，两个，是吧？两个半。啊？人家不感兴趣。哎。哎。<笑>嗯、We've just been playing board games, and it's now time to make dinner. So we're gonna be making seafood paella. We got a super cute pot. It's a little pink and pretty. And we also have a whole lot of prawns. Got some squid, some mussels, and maybe chicken liver. Wow, it's 6.6. 但是它它不算 overweight， 你看我一下，嗯，嗯，好乖，它这样抱都不动哎，可能过一会儿开始挣扎，哈哈 ，so cute， 有的没有这么乖吗？嗯，抱太久它就跑，嗯，它也是，哦，感觉是抱了一小毛球。